What's up, bros? Gaucho Hose here, Forever Beaster, and today we are here with another video. And today it's a story time, and I'm gonna be talking about some sad news. So, cur well, currently, and I think forever, me and Cool Dog are actually officially done being friends. The same with Orange. Pretty much, I think we're all just done with each other. I think we got tired of each other's bullshit, and and uh, sorry for my language, Susan, but I um. I had to say that because it, it's been a tough time with friendships and, you know. But, I'm going to be honest. Um, some of my internet buddies I don't see as friends to the end. Because, honestly, I, I realize they're not going to be there for me at all times. The only person I actually see that's going to be there for me at all times as an internet buddy is uh, my buddy JK and my school friends. So, um, so you guys. So, guys, by the way, the last videos you'll see Cool Dog in is the Watch Dogs 2 and the uh, the Gang Beast. That's the last ever videos you'll see them in. But that's just the big news. But today I'm just bringing story time. So um, let's just hop right into it. So it was a normal day for the most part. I was just hanging out with Cool Dog. Now I am going to have to leave some stuff out because um, me and him did get in a fight. And he later on posted it as a... Uh, well, a private, he posted a private conversation, and I didn't even know he was recording, which was very disrespectful. And, um, I'm just gonna have to, I'm not gonna say anything that, he, that we said in the private conversation, but I am gonna give a little detail, not too much. So, pretty much, we just got in a huge fight, things got really heated, and, um, when things get really heated, you know, it's just a big thing. So, pretty much, I, uh, me and him got in a fight, and then... Uh, we, everyone left the party, it was just a private conversation, it was just us, and then we started talking, and then I stopped talking, and, um, y yeah, and, and the reason why he got mad at me, I'm not gonna say everything we said in the video, but the reason why he got mad at me, because he thinks I'm cyberbullying Orange when that's not true, that's not true, I'm just doing videos, you know, making a living like everyone else. And, you know, Orange doesn't care. Orange barely even looks at my videos. And, well, no, actually, that's a lie. He looked at my video, and he saw he saw what I said, and he probably and he deleted the uh, plush videos because of that. So, Orange still watches my channel. So, Orange, if you're watching, uh, hi. Um, now, this isn't about Orange. Uh, this is just a, a story time. So, pretty much, me and, cool, me and Cool Dog just got in a heated fight, um... Let's see what I can say, because I'm not really too sure if I can say everything, because it was too private. Um, we got in a fight, I can't, and, uh, okay, okay, I can't say this. So, he thinks that everyone, he thinks that everyone is friendly, and he thinks people don't talk shit about each other. That's what I can say. I can't say everything else. But, what I can say is, he thinks that we live in this, and he... And I can also say this, at the end of the video, he says, he tells me to grow up, because after the fight, he tells me to grow up because he's saying I'm cyberbullying Orange and everything. And you want to know what's really ironic of him to say to grow up, is he tells me to grow up when he posts a private conversation. Now, that's the only thing I can say, I can't say too much, but pretty much I saw the video, and good thing he deleted it. Thank you for deleting it, Cool Dog, even though we're mad at each other, thank you for deleting it. I do, uh... Respect you for doing it, but so pretty much he says grow up beast bro And he call he pretty much calls me out because he literally says my full YouTube name in the video And he literally like he li he literally just full-on calls me out like like there's no doubt about that He just fucking calls me out no reason and and he says I'm cyberbullying And it's pretty ironic of him to say I'm cyberbullying him when he's literally cyber shaming me when you think about it like he he's literally shaming me and then he's made and then and then he does he does say this in the video not everyone's innocent but even though he says that he doesn't say what he does he said and I'm gonna tell you what he does say in the video now I'm not mentioning the conversation we had but he does say he does say this um shit what did he say he said he said um guys I'm gonna give you the truth on everything and this is and you know what that's not that's actually a lie because 
because um the thing because the things he gives the truth on is only the things he wants to give you the truth on not the things not everything he does is the truth and he tries to hide it and act innocent even though he says oh yeah i'm not innocent he doesn't mention why he's not innocent and while we were having our conversation, I got really mad, and, um, he, uh, he, he just, like, he blurts out what I said, because I said, you call me this every day, but he blocked out me saying, you call me this every day and everything, and, because his channel's, like, what, PG-13 for kids, but, um, that's no problem, but, so pretty much, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna like continue um, so pre but that was a part of the private conversation but I'm not gonna go there so then then later on I invite him to a party to say we need to talk because I got upset with what he was saying because bro like anyone that's watching this you would understand if someone posts a private conversation of your friendship on a public website for thousands millions of people to see you, you would understand how that feels too, because they're posting a private conversation you had between, and it's, and it's between you and that friend, and it's a bunch of drama only between you and that friend, and then someone posts it without your permission, and without your, like, pretty much without your permission to post it. He pretty much just posts a random, a random thing on YouTube, and you know, and you know what? This makes me funny. This makes it funny. So he says I use orange reviews, but here's the funny thing: he hasn't posted a video in two months on his channel, and that's like the video from like two months later that he posts on his channel. Isn't that funny? That that, and it's pretty ironic that he says I'm using orange reviews when obviously he was probably using that for views. So. Just saying, but I'm not trying to uh, start anything. I'm not trying to call him out. I'm just saying it's pretty ironic of him to tell me to grow up and then he posts a pri like. I'm just saying it's pretty ironic of someone to say, like, say grow up when they post a private conversation between you and that person on a public website. It's pretty ironic for someone to say that. And he and he said, what do you mean it's ironic? And I don't think he ever got the memo or anything. And then I just got really in, I, and like I was saying, we were talking to party. And I got really upset. And my friend was there. I told him to mute his mic because I didn't want him to get involved in my friend. And so I am going to say what I did say in the, in the conversation. Because this... This was not private, because my friend did hear, my friend did hear, but he stayed out of the conversation, he did not jump into it, he did not back me up, because I'm glad he didn't, because I didn't want him to get involved in my shit, I wanted to fix my shit, I wanted to say what I wanted to say, and this is exactly what I told him, I told him, I told him to stop living in his gay ass world where he thinks people don't talk shit about each other, when obviously, that's a lie, everyone talks shit about each other, let's be real, when was there a time nobody talks shit about each other? Unless you don't know that person, everyone talks shit about each other. Like, there is no way in hell nobody talks shit about someone. It like even like even you guys out there watching this, you know you talk shit about someone without like and you just didn't give a crap or maybe you just were in a bad mood or you were just mad at that person. You we all know we talk shit about someone once in a while. And you know what? He acts like he never talks shit about people. He acts like he's this innocent person living in a happy ass, gay ass world where we're all friendly. When obviously that's a fucking lie. Nobody's friendly these days. Let's be honest. When when was the last time the world came to an innocent bystander? Never. There's always someone talking shit about each other. Let's be real. I mean, I mean, there's a, there's a, there's a point where you're joking with someone, and there's a point where you're just talking shit about them, and me and my buddies, we joke around about each other, like, we make jokes about each other, like, we, like, make small pee-pee jokes, like, saying, oh, you have a small penis, or something like that, or we say, like, we, we, like, make fun of each other in a fun way, but when I'm talking about talking shit, I mean, they actually give zero fucks what they say about you, like, zero fucks, like, zero fucks at all, like, they just give zero fucks what they say about you, and they just don't care. They don't care at all. That's what I'm talking about. I'm not talking about where they make fun of you for, like, for the fun of it. They don't, like, make fun of you for a series. No, I'm talking about where they talk shit about you. And this is where, this is where it pisses me off. Cool Dog doesn't get that we don't, we don't live in a world where nobody talks crap about each other. We live in this world where everyone says something about each other. There's no, like, if you turn your back one moment, somebody is going to say something about you. It's not like we live in a world where nobody's going to say crap about you. 
It's not that type of world. And that's why I said it to him. And he, he just didn't get the memo. He obviously he obviously thought of himself. He thought of himself highly. And he tried to make himself sound like a good guy. The, the good guy. And he tried to hide his power and everything. And, you know, it just makes me mad that someone like him. And, he, and you know, like I said. I said this before. It's pretty ironic of him to say, grow up, beast, beast. But he posts a private conversation, and let me tell you guys this: even though sometimes I can seem like like a a jerk or or ever, I never post a friend a private conversation between me and a friend unless I have their. Okay, now you guys know that troll I did on Orange. That's a troll. Trolls and private conversations are two different things. I trolled them, messed around with them on. On more on um injustice, but when it comes down to a private conversation where someone's recording and you guys got in an argument, that's two different things. See, this is the reason why I stopped being friends with him because he's so arrogant and he's so untrustworthy. That's why I stopped trusting him completely. Like, and you know what? You know, you know, there's many terrible things he did. He catfished me, which was a fucked up thing to do, but I'm not going to name all the things he did, because that that's well, not what I'm here to do, I was here to tell a story, and that's it, and I did not tell too much of the private conversation, because I do not want to share that, but I shared what I needed to share, and that's it, so guys, thank you for watching, subscribe if you're new to the channel, like, comment below, and let me know your thoughts, like, when you guys, like, tell me, when you guys be up, like, I know this is a pretty obvious answer, but, Tell me, would you be upset if someone posted a private conversation of you guys getting in an argument and make you look like the bad guy? And, you know, they say they're not innocent, but they don't show that they're not innocent. They, they try to make themselves look like the good guy. Like, would you be upset about that when they're obviously lying about the truth? I mean, he obviously lies about the truth. But... I, but I just like just let me know down in the comments below and like some of you may not comment some people might not even comment at all but comment below would you be mad if someone uploaded a video of a private conversation a private conversation of an argument that you both got into and they tried to make you look like the bad guy would you be upset I want to know that would you be like upset about that so guys subscribe if you're new to the channel like comment below um, leave post notifications on, and I will catch you guys next when time. The sun so, uh, rises, yeah, see you guys. I wake up and chase my dreams. I won't regret when the sun sets, cause I live my life like I'm a